This is the Sony AX7. It's a portable theater system with 360 degree audio, 30 hours of battery life. It connects via Bluetooth. All you have to do is download the Home Entertainment Connect app for your iOS or Android device. Inside the box, you'll find a charging brick and a USB-C to USB-C cable. Here is the AX7. It comes with a main speaker and two satellite speakers that detach and connect wirelessly. On the back of the main speaker, you'll find a USB port to charge a device if you want and a USB-C port to charge the speaker. Here's the top of the main speaker with an on-off switch, a Bluetooth pairing button, play, pause, answer, call, volume up and down, and sound field button. These are the bottom of the satellite speakers. They connect to the main speaker via magnet. And on the top, they're made of a fabric. This is the top of the speaker again, but you can see the magnetic inputs and the controls. And then here's the back one more time with the USB ports and the bottom of the main speaker. To set everything up, just turn the main speaker on with the satellite speakers connected. It will automatically go into Bluetooth pairing mode the first time. Otherwise, just press and hold that Bluetooth button until it goes into pairing mode. Go into that Home Connect app that we downloaded just a bit ago, and you can walk through the setup. It's very, very simple. Here's a quick walkthrough on the app. You can see I can tell how much battery left I have left on the front and the left and the right speakers. I have night mode, which reduces the sound. I have sound field, which basically creates that 360 effect. You can turn that on or off right there. Voice mode increases the voices that you're listening to. So if it's a song or more likely a movie or TV show, you can increase that, the voices on there. Here's a mute button. Here is the volume button to control the overall volume of the device. You have your rear levels. You can increase or decrease or leave them at zeros. Bass level settings you can have bluetooth settings so you can change it if you want if you want a more stable connection or better overall quality of sound system settings auto standby is a cool one you can actually turn the device on and off after 20 minutes of inactivity so it'll automatically turn off if it's not playing anything bluetooth standby is a really cool one this allows you to turn your device this thing on and off with your phone through this app really like that Main operation sound, you can turn that on and off if you want. You can turn these lights on and off as well. I have it set to dimmer. This is bright. I don't know if you'll probably be able to tell the difference, but, and then you can also just turn the LED lights off if you don't want to see them. System information just gives you, you know, software and all that stuff information. Next, we have the software update. This is where you can download software updates if there are any. You can go through tutorials to learn how to use the actual device. And then going back here, like I told you, you can turn it on and off. It's now off and you can see it's off. I can turn it back on. So very cool that this goes into like a standby mode and I'm able to turn it on and off with my phone. Now you might be curious how strong these magnets are for these speakers. You know, I can pull them off pretty easy. It doesn't feel like much resistance, but what if you hold it upside down? Do they come off? Well, if you shake it, they do, but if you just turn it upside down, they will not. So as long, as long as you're not like really shaking these things, they'll stay pretty steady. Also, the buttons on here work really, really well. If you don't you want to use the app, you don't necessarily have to. You could just connect via Bluetooth to this. You, again, don't have to use that app at all if you don't really want to, if you just want to use this as kind of like a regular speaker type thing. So I'll just give you some sound samples of the speaker connected like this. just like as like a, if you're using it as a regular speaker, it sounds very good. Now the Sony AX7 as just a speaker that you would listen to in bed or on the floor, on the couch, in a chair, wherever you are, like just listening to it is actually a really, really good sounding speaker. What I love about it is when you listen to music 
and I'll show you a sample of that. And, or just watching TV show or movie or YouTube video, it really gives you that nice 360 immersive sound with the speaker on your left and on your right and right in front of you. see if that job that you offered was still available. Yes. A security guard. I will take anything. This place was huge in the 80s with the kids. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear, where fantasy and fun come to life. Effects that that one will have, and the bigger displays it'll have versus this phone and the Galaxy Z Fold 4. Z Fold 4 and the 5, let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below. Without further ado, let's get into our Q&A. Now I have to admit, it's a little bit hard to capture that experience and the great quality sound of a speaker because I'm using a microphone and you know the microphone has to be so close or has to be so good. And it's, so it's hard to capture that. So just keep that in mind when you're like hearing some of this stuff. It sounds really, really good. guys so the sony ax7 system what do i like what don't i like overall quality of the sound is very good it's got very good bass you can talk on the phone too with this thing so if you wanted to make a phone call and talk on it it has built-in microphones so you can do that the price is 499 bucks obviously this is kind of a niche product how many people are going to spend 500 bucks on a portable speaker system that they can take with them and use on a camping trip or at their house or in their bedroom or wherever they're going to do it like you know you're going to use this with a tablet a phone most likely you could use it with a gaming system like i showed you toward the end there on the rog ally but it's a very niche product i wish i wish i had some kind of handle so i could easily lug it around or some kind of bag um, because it is going to be something that you might not leave stationary you might want to bring this around so i mean of course you could throw it in some kind of bag that you have but it's, it would be nice if it came with a bag or it came with like a really sturdy handle i do wish that the magnets on the speakers the satellite speakers were stronger like really strong so i really had to like not use every ounce of strength to, to pull it off but it's just something stronger in case when I'm carrying it around or if I lug it around or if it's in my bag the, the speakers just don't come off but it's a very versatile speaker you saw I used it with uh, music I used it with uh, TV or in and YouTube videos and movie and I used it in a gaming system and using it with my ROG ally it's actually a really cool way to get th theater sound anywhere you are especially when you have a really powerful handheld gaming system so there's a lot of use cases for it it's just a niche product it's it's there it's got everything that you'd potentially want except for probably the things that I think it kind of needs it's like the way to easier way to hold it and all the other stuff but otherwise sounds very very good very happy with it overall if you want to pick it up it's linked down below thanks for watching have a great day we'll see you down the road peace